come from anywhere and anyone can be a partner on the rails with me. show tonight. I can't wait to see him. And that cool tiger painted on his side. And hear his whistle that sounds like a tiger. <laughs> Just like that. That must be him. Avast, landlubbers. There's a passenger on board who seems to be eager to see ya. Electric! it! Roar! Everyone, I'm so happy to be back with you all in Sodor. And I brought a surprise for the fireworks show tonight. All the way from China. Cool! That's awesome! Can you tell us again how you earned your totally cool and sort of scary tiger decal? Please! Oh, tell us! <laughs> oh, it wasn't such a big deal. I was just trying to help out. Come Can on! Please, with actual yeah. grease on top? Okay, okay. It was for the time I rescued... <gasps> Annie and Clarabelle? Annie and Clarabelle? I thought you rescued an engine from an ice cliff with a snowplow. No! James is pulling Annie and Clarabelle this way. But the crossing arm is stuck, and they don't see Gordon coming. We have to stop them. Oh, yeah. Guys, I was trying to say before... Gordon! Gordon! Thank you, Young Bao. Nicely done. Whew. Thank you, Young Bao. So electric. Oh, you weren't How even brave. scared. What's wrong, Thomas? Well, I should have been the one to have saved the day. I saw the crossing arm was stuck, and I was gonna tell someone, but... Yong Bao is our hero. Did you see that? Oh, yes. So you had a chance to be brave and missed it? Yeah. I wish I could have shown Yong Bao how brave I really am. Well... You may not be the bravest engine on Sodor, but you did get to see Yong Bao bravely leap to the rescue. Well, I would have too. You really are the bravest engine. Well, we'd better get to our delivery so we don't miss the fireworks tonight. Bye, y'all. Bye. Bye. <laughs> wow, I made a new sound. <gasps> I love it. Hey, 
sheep, listen. <gasps> They're jumpy today. <laughs> wow. Mm -hmm. Hi, Nia. Don't scare the butterflies, please. Oh, wow. Hey, have you heard my new sound? <gasps> uh, wow. That was pretty loud. But cool. But loud. Oh, no. It was too loud, wasn't it? Well, too loud for the butterflies. I'm going to find a place where it's okay to be loud. Good luck. Oh. <sighs> Here's a good spot. <laughs> Gordon, wait till you hear my new sound. Ania, what's wrong? Sorry I woke you up. I have a great new sound, but it's too loud to play anywhere. Well, sometimes it's fun to be loud. <laughs> you need to find a place where being loud won't make others cranky. Cranky? Great idea, Gordon. Oh, what are you doing here, Nia? This. <gasps> wow, nice loud sound. I like it. <laughs> nice one, Bullstrode. than I've ever gone to the lighthouse. The lighthouse? Well, that's too far when the wind is this strong. You'll never make it on your own. <laughs> what? I like the wind. I can get there and back all by myself. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. This wind is so strong and gusty. I can't steer. Whoa. Maybe Cranky was right. Skiff, mind if I come along? Thanks for the wind block, Bullstrode, but I really wanted to sail to the lighthouse all by myself. You're still the one sailing. We're just cruising along next to each other. Hey, good point. Lighthouse, here I come! Whoa, is that Skiff? Hey, Skiff. I've never seen you this far from the docks before. That's because it's a new record. Great job. Hi, Volstrode. Hi, Thomas. See you later, Skiff. Be careful getting home. Don't worry. After getting here, getting home is going to be a breeze. Huh? Oh, no. Oh, now. Slow down. I told you it was too windy to make it all the way to the lighthouse. But he did make it there all by himself. Well, uh, good job then, I, I guess. Uh, how'd you do it? Well, I had a little help from Bullstrode blocking the wind for me. Aw, I only helped a little bit. Turns out going alone is a lot more fun when you take somebody with you. <laughs>
What do you think we'll find? Nobody knows what a rainbow holds But I have a few things in mind Hey! What's at the end of the rainbow? It's gonna be a great surprise Hey! What's at the end of the rainbow spin? Look! It's some old rail ties? That doesn't seem right Hey! Over there! We're so close now, and we're gonna give it all we've got. Aw, oh, Bolt. What's at the end of the rainbow? What do you think we'll find? Nobody knows what a rainbow holds. But I have a few things in mind. Hey! I hope what we find is a golden headlight. I hope it's new wheels so shiny and so bright. What's at the end of the rainbow? Oh, what's at the end of the rainbow? Hey, it's gonna be a great surprise. What's at the end of the rainbow span? You won't believe your eyes. Why do you have all this stuff? It's all very important stuff. You're not using it. But you can take it to Whips so someone else can reuse or recycle it. Huh. Good point. You know what? Let's take it all to Whips Recycling right now. Okay. All ready to sort and recycle. Goodbye, bike. Hope someone finds you and loves you. These old bicycle wheels would make perfect engine gaskets. Goodbye, old computer monitor. Hey, I can use this for my greasifier. It's such a good idea to get rid of all this stuff. Goodbye, fridge. <laughs> this is still useful. And goodbye, shoe. Join the other... What? Where's the other... Oh. Well, I'm not gonna waste it. I'm just gonna reuse it myself. Will you? Or is it gonna end up spilled all over the place again? Not if you help me, because you are super good at organizing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yay! Hmm. One more thing, and... Ta-da! <laughs> that looks great! Thanks, Carly. And look, I made this for you. You actually did reuse that old boot and created something beautiful. And I can put it right here. Carly, no! Sandy? Maybe I can reuse some help. <laughs> rolling round, rolling fast to Vickers Town. <gasps> oh no! Ducks on the track! My cargo! Phew! Landed ship shape. Train coming through. Sorry, but I have to get this stuff to Vickerstown. Time to waddle on, ducks. I'm in a hurry. Ducks, time to go. No? Okay, then. I'm going to toot scoot you out of the way. Now scoot! Good morning, Nia. I'm stopped at a red light. When that light turns green, I have to go. Now scoot! <laughs> Wait, <laughs> that tickles. <laughs> a red light? Great. <laughs> Nia, the light is green. Stop playing with those ducks and go! Ah! Real funny. Now let me out. Oh, 
Sorry, gotta go. But I need to get to Vickerstown. I have the perfect plan. <laughs> this is your perfect plan? Yes, you're cute. But that tickles. <laughs> Away? Come on, knights! Let's catch that dragon! Huzzah! Hmm? Huh? Must be my incredibly vivid imagination again. <laughs> oh, of course, it's just a dragon! A dragon? Run away! <laughs> I see. Well, perhaps this time one of you can be the dragon and I'll be the handsome and almost unbearably charming knight. I'll be the dragon this time. Dragon? There's a dragon? Run away! Run away! Roar! Come, Knight Kara. Let's save the kingdom from the beast! Lead the way! Lead the way! Come on! I've never seen anything like this before. Awesome! We are almost to the seashore. No more dark tunnels. Nope. Nothing but beautiful scenic countryside. Huh? <gasps> the bridge is up! And no electricity to bring it down. What will we do? Connor, dear, can you do something? Connor, are you able to connect to the bridge like you did to the tunnel? Electric idea! Let's find out! I can plug in and power the bridge. No power, no problem. Something wrong? <sighs> the bridge is down. But now, so is my battery. I'm out of power. It's okay. Go on to Vigor's Town. I'll be fine. Grab on, Connor. Everything's connected, right? Now you're connected to me, and I'm going to Vigor's Town. Way to go, Purse. On the left is the Vickers Town Lighthouse. It's dark right now, but when it's lit up, it's... <gasps> Spectacular! <laughs> Incredible! Just beautiful. Thank you. We definitely got our scenic route, as promised, Thomas. Well, the electricity's all connected, but so are we. We all did it together. Yep! <laughs> I'm sure this tour will be the highlight of their visit. Oh, oh, Annie, I made a pun. Oh, you did. Good one, Clary. Hi there. I'm all charged up and ready to go. Come on. Why don't we all connect for the ride home? Hook me in. I'll lead the way. Electric! Oh. <laughs> 
clean after a good scrub. Okay, Sandy, your turn. No! I don't want to take a bath! Aw, come on, Sandy. Don't you want to be clean and shiny like me? No! I like being muddy. It's my look. Besides, you're just gonna get all dirty again. Maybe, but I'll make you a deal. If I can stay clean all day, then you have to take a bath. You are on! Hope you don't have any dirty deliveries today. <laughs> Pigs? Ah, oh, bolts. Bet you can't stay clean. I'm taking them to the farm, not rolling in the mud with them. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. Oh, what a bright, shiny, sparkly, clean day. Easy greasy. And I'm still clean as a whistle. Have fun in the mud. Whoa, Piggy, look out! Ah, oh, bolts. Thomas, what happened to you? I fell in the mud, and I bet Sandy had to stay clean all day. Yes, I knew 
I'd win. Well, why don't you take another bath before she sees you? No, I have to tell her the truth. Are you looking for the winner? I'm right here. Huh? Whoa! You got a much mustache. Whoa! Look, I'm all clean. Oh. <laughs> I'll wash off if I can do it like that. Let's get clean. I'm so glad you're okay. <laughs> but you're a little sticky. Hey, maybe we can use the sticky goop to fix the bouncy castle. Great idea, Kana. But let's fill the castle first. Oh, me, 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 me. Here you go, Percy. And while you do that, I'll get some goop for the pack. Whooshin' time. <laughs> Thank you, Kana. Look at that. All good is new. Well, almost all. Wait, maybe we could fix the calliope with goo, just like we fixed the bouncy castle. Wow, we did it! <sighs> I'm sorry, calliope. I really loved how you went. Yeah, I miss it. I really like the... And how about the... No way. The best was the... Hey, everyone, do that again. Do what again? Make all those musical sounds. Okay. <laughs> Wow! Together, we sound a lot like the Calliope. If we work together, I bet we can fill in at the carnival. <gasps> I am so happy to see you. I was starting to worry something terrible had happened. What's this? We hit a few snags along the way. Oh, don't worry. A bouncy castle is as good as it bounced. And this one still got it. Clever patch. No. No, no, no. Not the Calliope. How did this happen? I'm sure I just heard it playing. Actually, you heard us working together. Let's show him, everyone. <gasps> Taking letters and packages down the rail. My favorite thing is to deliver the mail. <laughs> hey, Purse. You're looking excited today. Just one delivery left. It's a super special party balloon for Sir Topham Hat. Look! It's getting away. I have to get that back. Come on, back up, back up, back up, back up. Go, go, go. I have to get that back. There it is. <gasps> I got it. I don't got it. Hey, come back here. We have to get it back, or Sir Topham Hat's party will be ruined. Follow that seagull! Well, hello there. Excuse me, Cranky. Will you lift me up to those gulls? I suppose so. Percy, you're scared of heights. What are you doing? I have to deliver all the mail. That means getting my... <laughs> balloon! <laughs> Okay, let's deliver this balloon. Come on! 
on, look, amigo. I got you. Sir Topham Hat, your special party balloon. Oh, yes, perfect. Thank you. I'll add it to the others. The others? They're lovely. Oh, oh dear. Boys, would you mind? Follow that, Sir Topham Hat. Oh, my. Don't worry, Sir Topham Hat. We'll get you back to the party. Straight to the docks and be careful. We want to surprise Sir Topham Hat when he gets back from the mainland. Don't worry. I'll be so careful. <laughs> Not confetti. What's wrong, Diesel? I thought everyone liked confetti. Everybody loves confetti. Just not in their intake vents. Thomas, I told you to be careful. I was careful. You should be careful, like the careful list. Oops, Miss Um. Now remember. Whoa! Hey, where did the confetti cart go? There. Let's go. Be careful, or the confetti will explode again. Wait! Sandy's right. We have to be careful. I'm being careful. Oh, no! Ah! How is it not exploding? Ah! Okay, this is getting ridiculous. <laughs> this way! Well, my eye spy something blue. Is it me? <laughs> no, they have a beautiful smell. So, not me. Uh, Diesel's right. There's nothing to see here except for tracks and trees. Yes, there is. It's those blue flowers right beside the tracks. Oh, I never noticed those. Mia! How do you even see this stuff? Well, we don't have those flowers where I grew up in Kenya. When I saw them, I thought they were so beautiful. And they only grow in Sodor. Okay, but really, what's a secret? <laughs> Everywhere I go, I ask myself, what's awesome about this place? Hmm, let me try. My eyes spy. <gasps> those hanging vines! Those flowers are pretty awesome. And, oh, my eyes spy, that shadow you're making, Mia. It looks just like a dinosaur. <laughs> awesome. Roar! Ooh, ooh, let me try. I spy this gravel. Oh, that's so amazing. And that rusty old switch, so beautiful. It's true. I never noticed that rusty switch before. Now you're getting it. There's so much to see if you just take a moment to look around. I know. I've been in the dark woods so many times, but everywhere I look, I see new things. It's blowing my mind. <laughs> Let's catch up to Nia. Uh, guys, you'd better slow down. Slow down? Whoa! my bumpers that was close. Whoa! Oh no! The orange tree! We can't show up to the plaza without those amazing orange trees. But I'm sure we can think of something else to bring. Nia's right. There must be something else we can do. No, nothing will be as awesome as those orange trees. 
Except, maybe those orange flowers in that bush I never noticed before. <gasps> we can use flowers from Sodor for the plaza. Oh, yeah. We passed lots of plants that would be perfect. Great idea. I feel the need to lead with speed. That's a lot of hay. It's no joke. My coupler broke. The cows need this hay. Well, it's on my way. I'll take it. You gotta watch your stack out on the track. Remember, it's tall. To tell the truth, one little goof, and the whole thing's gonna fall. Got it. I'm gonna lay on the speed. There's cows to feed. Uh-oh. Watch out for the uh. tunnel. You can't come this way. You'll lose your hey. How do you moo? I got food for you. What? <gasps> My bales of hay went away. I know what's in this. Are you looking for this? I went too fast and lost my stack. But you had good friends who brought it back. Absolutely. Thanks for bailing me out on my unstacked route. But I'm back on track. I've learned to keep an eye on my stack. I can clear that, no problem. It might be a little problem. Good luck with the traffic. Huh, it's nothing but grassy fields and blue skies out here. Right, sheep? <gasps> Cracked couplers! Where did all this traffic come from? <clears throat> you got this, Percy! I think I can. I think I can. I think I... Thanks, cow. Any chance you want to be my new BFF? Bovine friend forever? Traintastic! Although, I am a little worried about Thomas. He took the lunnies for my mail route, and you would not believe how jammed it gets this time of day. <sighs> Is the traffic always this bad? Ha ha ha! You are listening! I don't need Percy. It's just you and me, sheepy old pal. Which ain't so bad. <sighs> Percy would have laughed at that. Who am I kidding? I miss my best friend. Thomas? Why haven't you dropped your delivery off yet? Isn't it obvious? I'm stuck in traffic. Wait, where's Percy? He uh, took a little detour. Don't tell me you two haven't made up yet. Well, he started it. Or maybe I did. I wonder if he's having as much trouble as I am. <sighs> Thanks for trying, cow. But it's no use. I'll never get this delivery done without my best buddy, Thomas. What am I gonna do, Nia? Why don't you just ask Percy for help? This is his mail route, after all. He'll know a way around it. I, I can't. We're not exactly friends anymore. And besides, He's probably made it to Normby without me. So, if Percy was nearby, would you ask him for help? Yeah. Good, because Percy's right over there. Wait, what? Percy! <gasps> I was really hoping Thomas wouldn't see me. Can you help Thomas get out of this traffic? We're still not talking. But if someone wanted to avoid the traffic, they could back up a few feet and take the siding over there to get to this track. Thomas, it's right here. Thanks, Percy! <sighs> you both 
both are being silly. If I was a super train, I'd always do good deeds. Here to there and everywhere. Thanks to my super speed. Woohoo! If I was a super train, I'd use my super steam. I'd slip inside so I could hide and not be super seen. If you were super train, you do a lot of good. But anyone can be a hero. Right in their neighborhood. I'd be so strong and fly so fast. Having superpowers is a super blast. Superpowers are great, it's true. But nothing's more super than just being you. If I was a super train, I'd always do good deeds. Here to there and everywhere. Thanks to my super speed. Woohoo! If I was a super train, I'd use my super steam. I'd slip inside so I could hide and not be super seen. If you were super train, you'd do a lot of good. But anyone can be a hero right in their neighborhood. I'd be so strong and fly so fast. Having superpowers is a super blast. Superpowers are great, it's true. But nothing's more super than just being you. If I was a super train, the world would cheer my name. But even if you lost your powers, I'd like you just the same. I sure am feeling unlucky. Without Percy's bell with me. There's mud and rocks and sharp lands too. So much in my way. Without Percy's bell keeping me safe, will I be okay? I sure am feeling unlucky because I wasn't as careful as I should be. I found it! I sure am feeling lucky because I've got this bell with me. I don't need to feel afraid, won't bend or break or fall Because I've got a special bell that takes care of it all I sure am feeling lucky, cause I've got this bell with me Caves, monsters, or broken track, I think I'll be okay This lucky bell sure has a knack for saving every day I sure am feeling lucky, cause I've got this bell with me I think I'll be okay. This lucky bell sure has a knack for saving every day. I sure am feeling lucky, cause I've got this bell with me. Percy gave this bell to me, I'm lucky he's my friend. So I'll take care of Percy's bell until the very end. I sure am feeling lucky, cause I've got this bell with me. Line up, racers. First engine to Vickerstown wins! Ready, set, all engines go! Yeah. All right! Yeah. Oh, you got this! You oh, got yeah. it! <laughs> uh oh! Oh no! Hold on tight! The 
number one engine was faster than that. That's all you got? Not even close. Here comes super speed! Woohoo! Come on, Thomas! Whoa! I can still win. Chugga chugga! Woohoo! Just like Thomas's light. Thomas! You forgot one of your lights! <sighs> okay, guys, first month or Vickerstown Station after me is the winner! Thomas, you sure are speedy. That was amazing. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Number one, lots of fun. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. <gasps> Come on. It's probably okay. Don't blow a gasket. Maybe we can fix it before Gordon gets here. I'm <gasps> here. Well, how did your deliveries go, hmm? Are all of the lights safe and not broken? I, um, well, you see... <gasps> Gordon, the truth is... The tracks were bumpy! <laughs> what? They were. But that's not how it broke. Well, this is a problem. <laughs> but <laughs> accidents happen. <laughs> Besides, the Festival of Lights will still be grand with your second light. Phew! <laughs> My second light. <gasps> Where is my second light? You, uh, you did have the second light, <laughs> correct, Thomas? Um, be right back. No one on the rails today but me. Just the way I like it. Mama. <laughs> mama. What? Mama. I'm not your mama. You want something with feathers who says caca and... Mama! No! Mama! No! Mama! No! Mama! You don't give up, do you? What's your name, little guy? Mama! Okay, I'll call you Wilson. Hello, Wilson. I'm Diesel. Now we're buddies. Next stop, Brendam Docks to find your... Mama! Not your mama. More like a big brother. Mama! Wilson, you have to be more careful. Mama! <laughs> no, more like a super strong uncle. Don't worry, Wilson. We'll find your mama here. Mama! Hey, Diesel. Looks like you picked up a passenger. <laughs> I'm trying to find his mama. Mama! Well, I'm glad he's found his mama. They grow up so quickly. It's hard to see them leave the nest. <clears throat> you did a good thing. Helped him find his mama. Yeah, I guess so. Huh. Better go pick up my delivery. <gasps> mama! Now she shouldn't be down here. She should be up at the duck pond. Okay, ducky. I'll take you home. But mama's work is never done. <laughs> yeah, you're a cutie. Well, we're just gonna have to put our heads together and think of something new. Between you and me, we'll find the plan B or C or D. Between me and you, we'll get this delivery through. I've got an idea. Sugar and flour will be our base stacked up right. Make a pretty sweet. Keeping eggs, milk, and butter in the right place So I won't get more egg on my face Between you and me We'll find a plan B or C or D Between me and you 
Well, this is a fine how do you do. Hi, Gordon. Everything okay? No. Thomas and I are delivering ties to the bottom of the mine, but my headlight just burned out. I can't join him without it. Oh, well, I can help you. Stick close to me. I'll light the way. Thank you, Nia, but do be careful. This mine can be a dangerous place. <laughs> Watch out, Nia! A runaway car! Um, Gordon? That's your car. In my car? Oh, yeah, we have to catch it. Go oh, this way. Here. Ah, there it is. Whoa. Oh, we're getting close. Come on. Ooh. Oh, I forgot how beautiful the Crystal Cavern is. It's incredible. Oops. Yeah, this mine is quite spooky enough without that, Nia. <laughs> Thank you very much. Sorry, this is just a little setback. I think your car ended up over here. Oh. What was that? One of the crystals. It lit up. Whoa! <gasps> Come on! The crystal cavern is going to help us find your car and get out. Bum! Ah. Ding, ding, dong, ding. <laughs> Whoa! We found my car! Yes! Um, what are you doing? <laughs> Dancing! Look! <gasps> Let me try! I think we just might dance our way to a delivery. Oh, yeah! Plus zero, added up to zero fun. Turns out the no fun number isn't always the number one. On my own, on my own. As long as I can pretend I'll never be alone. On my own. You can sail across the seven seas, rule a kingdom from a throne. Take a trip on a rocket ship, past the moon to the unknown. On my own. On my own. I thought that one plus zero added up to zero fun. Turns out the no fun number isn't always the number one. On my own. On my own. As long as I can pretend. Across the seven seas, rule a kingdom from a throne. Take a trip on a rocket ship, past the moon to the unknown. On my own, on my own. As long as I can pretend I'll never be alone. On my own, on my own, all on my own. I thought being number one was done so easily. Just gotta be. Strong when the load is heavy, revved up and at the ready. Faster than any other train, shiny with the glossy coat of paint. Taking the lead in a big delivery. This is all I thought that a number one engine should be. But being number one's not easy as it seems. You've gotta be willing to offer your help, put others before yourself. Know when you should apologize, be honest, loving, and kind. Now I can see a brighter side of me. A true friend to all is how a number one engine should be.
Thanks for the help loading, Carly. No problem, Cranky. Loading Volstrode is fun. Watch this, Sandy. Ugh. Nice lift, Carly. Maybe one day you'll be as strong as Cranky. As strong as me? <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, yeah? Well, how about this? That's a pretty big load, Carly. That was pretty big, Cranky. Can you top it? Of course I can. Look at this. Whoa, take it easy now. Wow. How are you going to beat that one, Carly? Hmm. That's nothing. How about this? Excuse me. What's happening? I'm... How about this? Oh, yeah? Hmm. Hey, Carly, do this one next. About this. Oh no! Bullstrode! Oh, sorry, pal. Whoa! Was that really necessary? No, it was not. But it was amazing. Ah, uh, enough playing around. Let's work together. It doesn't have to be a contest. <laughs> oh no, now what have we done? I got this. Well, I guess our lifting contest was a tie. Hey, guys, is the telescope here yet? Not yet. Bullstrud should be here any. <gasps> Thomas, what happened? What do you mean? Ah! Thomas, I told you not to cut through Crumble Canyon. So that's what you said. I knew it was something like that. You look terrible. Like, really terrible. Huh? Pfft. I just got a little dinged up. No biggie. Thomas, what on earth? You have to get to Tidmouth right now. Right now? But I want to see the new telescope. You know, but you have to get repainted immediately. You don't want to rust, do you? Rust? I'm so glad you came to see me. You've got a bad case of the scrapes. Aww. Can't believe I'm gonna miss Cranky unloading the new telescope. Scratches and dings do turn to rust if you don't fix them, Thomas. And you don't want rust, Thomas. Rust is the worst. I hear it's super itchy and scratchy and really uncomfortable. Oh, it is. You should be fine, Thomas. See, got you all fixed up with a fresh new coat of paint. Good as new. Great. Thanks, Sandy. 